Hello and welcome to Geekly Game Labs. I am Michael Thrifty Nerd tomorrow, and with me is Timothy Lanning. Hey everybody! Uh, we're gonna try something a little bit different today. And uh, did I hit? I, I ever hit the record button? <laughs> yes, I did. Uh, we're gonna try something a little bit different today. We're gonna play uh, Luftrausers. Luftrausers. And uh, we're gonna just do like a quick little run through it. And, yeah, man. Uh, and see what's up. Yeah. Um, this is, should be here. Luftrausers, which is German for air outing. Air out er. Um, air. Yeah, I think it means farting. air. It's probably air means farting. outer. Farting, maybe? Air farter. So this comes from, um, um, what is it? Vlambeer. Vlambeer. Yeah, the folks that brought you ridiculous fishing and so forth. And uh, Tim and I have both been, this is also, we're playing on a PC right now, but it's also out on PS3 and Vita. Yes. Uh, Tim, you've been playing it on Vita? Yeah, the Vita version's great. I should have a textural-based review of it soon. I just can't kill a dang blimp, and I want to do that before I put my pen to paper. A dirigible, you would say? A dirigible. I would say dirigible. I would say that. Um, I think it's also fair to say that we're both kind of obsessed with this game. Yeah, I play it a lot. Um, so basically, you've got uh, you, you've got your ship, or you got your aer aeroplane, and you can customize it. Um, I've unlocked most of this stuff. So there's a cannon, missiles, spread, laser, random. Um, and then you've got a different body. There's bombs, nukes. Nuke blows up <laughs> when you crash into things. Yeah, you really need to kill a blimp, man. Your I know, dude. Your challenges are. It's not good. Um, so yeah, so I need to kill a blimp, but I don't know how. Wait. I don't know how to do it. So. But you need your own specific type of uh, loot browser or yeah. whatever your airplane. It's pretty dope. I'm gonna try this kind of thing. Oh, that's a great one. Uh, so basically, I have to try to score over ten thousand. Let's see what happens. Uh, so basically, it's a little dog fighting thing with this interesting palette that's very limited, um, and you just dog fight. You just fight yeah, dogs. Man. And uh, there's uh, the sky or the cloud coverage above you. There's the water beneath you, and uh, all the other ships are just shooting at you, being all rude. Yeah, they're rude. So dudes. if you if you hit the water, you get hurt. If you get right. hit by the bullets, you get Whoop. hurt. Unless you have the water body. Yeah, there is a water body that you can. Uh, or like water engine, I think it is. Right. Or is it, yeah, it's yeah. You're doing great so far. You're gonna lose your multiplier. Ah, uh, oh, damn. Multiplier. Um, so yeah, so you gotta like combo to get your multiplier up. So you're, it's a, basically all score based. And, yeah. Uh, oh, that's a battleship. Yeah. So the whole thing is try to pick out what type of uh, airplane you want based on you know your skills, or based on the particular challenges you're trying to unlock at that moment. Right. I, that's basically what I've been doing. It's just oh, God. To try to unlock and stuff and whatever an the easiest thing. There's an you down. And, and there's both uh, levels and you unlock more weapons based on level and challenges. I'm not too sure what the breakdown is to be, to be QH. Take that, you dumb ace. Oh, I just owned that guy. Yeah, you made him. You made him cry. So you got your basic flying mechanic, you know, speed. You got boosting, all that stuff. All right. Um, if you take damage, then you can just not shoot for a while, and you'll automatically repair. Exactly. And most pieces of um, equipment or have a balance. So uh, your laser might be stronger, but it causes you to regain health slower or your body might explode upon impact but if you get hit by someone else you get you take more uh oh there's a blimp there's a blimp uh how am i gonna beat it i think it's up and to the left yeah blimps are like flying battleships so you gotta be careful and i have never beaten one yeah there you uh... go Maybe if I just run into it real hard. Nope. Nope. Damn, that was close. Because you didn't have the melee body. So I had the melee body. Yeah. Kill blimp. That was dumb. 
what I did. It was a little, but I was very proud of you. You did great. Maybe I'll try the melee body now. I do melee enjoy. Body's hard. I do enjoy running into things. I will admit. Yeah, it, it, it is. It is the good shit. Um, but now I have less health. I think. Right? Yeah. Yes, you have less health, which means you can only get hit twice <laughs> by those little beams. Which sucks. Yeah. Uh, and also an awesome thing is every single like combination has a name. Yeah, they do, and they're all pretty good. Yeah, I love the one that's called Staff Pick. I'm like, huh? Maybe <laughs> I should be using this. <laughs> um, so yeah, so basically I'll just do this for a while, and it's fun. Yeah, it's and, a and classic... Then time, time flies away from me. It's like, geez, two hours later, how did this happen? Um, do you have other friends that are playing it so you can kind of get that leaderboard situation going on? Um, just... no, I don't... Yeah, because the, the Vita friends. and the computer entertainment system is not connected. Right. So, so I can't be trying to play my... Man, I kind of feel like the Vita might be the way to go with this game. Yeah, uh, I'm blaming the fact that you have a higher score than me on the fact that you're playing on PC. Uh -huh. But, uh -huh. you know, the Vita version is, is, is great. I feel, oh. I, feel like, I feel like you should get a higher score than me. I feel like it's even better that I have a higher score than me. Oh, wait. Yeah. I, get, I don't know, maybe. All right, so what are you do? are you using WASD and mouse and keyboard? How's yeah, this work? Yeah, so it, um, you use the arrow keys. Which uh -huh. is kind of weird. So you're you're running. You're using your right hand. Oh lord. Oh, that was look, guys. That is textbook dodge right there. I got two aces on me now. Great. Um, yes. Yeah, and then you just press the X button to fire. Okay. I almost got ten thousand. I came close, you guys. That was a great run. Uh, let's go back to the hangar and swap out this. Oop. Nope. Um, let's go back to the hangar and swap out this laser for something more awesome. How about spread? Yeah, spread's great. Really need to kill a blimp. Yeah, it's gonna... Karate Rausa. So the spread, it, its drawback is that it pushes you. So, like, you can't go as fast. Like, if you're going in one direction, like the band, uh, <laughs> your, your spread shot is gonna be pushing you, making you slower. Here's the thing, but, I fly backwards almost the entire time. So. Yeah. That's so why I like to use okay the, me. the hover engine with it, so you're just like constantly flying backwards. Because <laughs> uh, I've been using the hover engine with spread and the uh, heavy body because I, I like it. That's your go-to. Yeah, it's been my go-to for a little bit. Um, I was doing the uh, the engine where it shoots behind you. Yeah, yeah. For a long time. Which, actually, kind of the worst, but yeah, I think it's good for getting the like some of the early challenges, but yeah, gets, later you want you gotta get that you gotta keep that control, well, you gotta whole, keep that speed. Right. The whole thing was I just couldn't, I couldn't get the last challenge, and okay. so I just kept trying to do it, and then it's like I've been playing this game like ninety percent of the time with this stupid thing. Stupid thing. Yeah. Um, I don't know how you unlock those skull challenges maybe I, I think you, get you have to level. I think you have to do all of the other challenges Ugh. um yeah that's, that's, that's so risky there was no there's nobody to shoot all right that is a shame when you run out of folks to shoot and then you basically lose your score multiplier that you worked right. so hard on no. all right let's try yeah. to hover you want to hover yeah, hover's, hover's good shit grasshopper yeah okay going backwards <laughs> I'm confused. Slowly but steady, going backwards fast. Um, oh, what the? Yep, yep. Wow. That's a problem with the melee body. All right, let's change the body. <laughs> let's go. Uh, oh, there's nuke. Let's do nuke. Is the graph? Yeah. I love the. Um, I love the way that it looks. The yeah. Nuke, the, the nuke goes off. We'll oh, I will die soon enough, and then you'll see it. And you'll notice that the ship changes uh, shape. Mm -hmm. Also, so it's like you got your wings, you got your body, and you have your engines. So you can eventually unlock the random mode, where you can just put random for every piece of your ship. What? And the only way you can figure out what you're actually doing is by knowing what every single part looks like. <laughs> yeah, there. 
This is the longest I've ever gone without being attacked. What's happening? Yeah, I was a little confused. You're usually like swarmed by the small fighters. Right. Usually there's like a million of them. Yeah. The game starts with small fighters and boats, and then it'll add in destroyers or battleships, or whatever they're called. Mm -hmm. And then it'll throw in aces. It'll throw in. Oh, there it goes. Yes. Um, submarines, submarines, uh, jets, blimps, laser aces. It can be crazy. And there's tons of challenges just based off kill this or kill that, you know. And it kind of makes me sad. <laughs> it makes you kill sad. two battleships in one game. You can do that. Kill two aces in one combo. That's not That's too bad. So, uh, so now I'm playing slow. Root browser. Uh, uh, yeah, so now he has the oop, okay. oop. He has the gun that takes forever to shoot. And I also realized a downside to this gun is that while it's recharging, you're not healing, which is poop. Whoa, seriously? Yeah, you have to you, you know that you're ready to shoot again if you hear yourself start healing again. Whoa, I had no idea. Yeah. That's a so that this one's really great at getting quick combos, but then you like will lose completely. Uh, everyone's dead like really fast. So it's like you're combo fast, and then All right. yeah, so you're just taking on this battleship. Yeah, I want to take this guy down. Take you want to sink him? Is what you're trying to tell me? Yes. Oh, Jesus. Oh, Jesus. Oh boy. Uh, you need to heal. You need uh, to heal. The other thing that's really amazing about this game is just the music. Yeah. Music is so good. And it, it, I mean, it handles well, too, so... Ah! Aha! I got him. I thought I was dead. Woohoo! Take that, Battleship. Yeah. The, yeah, the, the sound design is integral to figuring out just what's going on, too. Right. That's the easiest way to, to find out when a um, submarine is attacking you, because you'll see them shooting missiles or what have you. And then at the more advanced stages, your, I guess you'll say, control tower will be like, uh, I don't know what's happening, but there's something filling the screen, or, ah, uh, this thing is crazy. And you'll eventually, as you unlock more and more stuff, you'll get these tiny baby cutscenes that, um, don't really have a lot of stuff to them, but they're right. just really quick and weird. All right, everything is super fast. You just, you know, as you can see, you just like die, and then you're just back in the game like two seconds yeah. later. Yeah, um, and there's no, there's no story. It's just play this game that is fun and try to get a billion points. Try to unlock the challenges. Real old school game fun. Yeah, and it's kind of almost got like an iOS feeling to it with the yeah. unlocking challenges. Um, yeah, but I've in a good way. Exactly, I've been trying to formulate, I've been thinking of the same thing, but that almost sounded... Uh, it sounds derisive, but it's, it's yeah. not. I mean, it's great. Yeah, exactly. It has that iOS itch of, like, just one more game, just one more game, slowly but surely unlocking new things, getting stronger. Oh, Jesus. Yeah, oh, Jesus. It's not going well. Yeah. Um, so that's Luftrausers. That's Luftrausers. Uh, uh, you can get it on all sorts of platforms. Yeah, it's only I think like, it's great. I think it's ten bucks. It's only like eight dollars if you have PS Plus. So definitely Ooh. worth it. Yeah, and again, the Vita version is great. Uh, it's crossplay, so I think you get it on both PS3 and Vita. Ooh, interesting. Yeah. Interesting. So I can't admit in my heart that Thrifty's better than me at this game because his score is double mine. <laughs> uh, so I'll go ahead and well, maybe see. I'll maybe I'll grab the Vita and see uh, see if it is really that. So maybe that's <laughs> it. Maybe it's just easier on the PCs. I beat it. It's this game too easy. But oh, it's great, Vita. I when I'm sitting on the train, b bouncing my head up and down to the music, and then I die. I'm like fuck. Uh, people look at me. And they're like, I'm like, you would cry too if this happened to you. <laughs> and on that bombshell, uh, we'll see you guys later. Yeah, thanks for watching. Find more of our stuff, uh, of course, at geeklyinc.com.